Ladies and gentlemen, American American German Bulldog Nation, welcome to the Eric Dieter Show. I've got a lot to talk about, mostly Trump. Trump is blowing out Biden. It's now a 10-point national lead, and it's going to keep on going. And you know why? People that would ordinarily not vote for Trump are waking up to what a disaster Biden is. Biden is such a disaster, no spin, nothing is gonna pull him out of it. All right, Trump economy. Voters are saying, it's obvious, Trump's economy was better than the Biden economy. And if you go by what the political experts say, people vote economy over everything else. All right, Trump, Jack's missing a little bit of trouble. And the reason why is because they rearranged some of these documents that don't measure up. In other words, it looks like Jack Smith was playing funny with some exhibits. Probably some kind of technical violation, but it's a great thing for Trump to go off on. All right, VP audition this weekend. All the front uh, runners for VP were down at Mar-a-Lago or near Mar-a-Lago hanging out with the billionaires class, being interviewed, talking to them, so forth, so on. Why? It looks like to me that Trump wants to make sure his biggest and best financial backers are behind the pick. Makes sense. Trump showed up at the Miami Grand Prix and he was received very well, including by the McLaren team. All right. Trump, his plan is to send 20 million illegals back using the military. Why not? When asked about all his legal woes, this is hysterical. Trump says life is life. What do I say every day when something bad happens, Jamie Spinley? What's the word I say when something bad happens? The one word that I say. Life. Life. Yeah. Yeah. Life. Trump yeah. is Trump listens to our show, obviously. You say life's life. I always say it's life. All right, Trump. All right. The young voters are going for Trump, as well as the black voters, Hispanic voters. Trump raised 76 million in April. That's good news for him. Trump's assistant, Hope Hicks, cried on the stand Friday. By the way, she's she's like 38. She's marrying a 53-year-old, a 58-year-old or something like that. Imagine that, some billionaire. Well, not billionaire. He's the head of Saks. All right. Uh, she hurt the prosecution because she said Trump only cared about protecting his family and said Michael Cohen was the fixer because he broke everything. Wow. Trump is using an ad with the UNC frat boys who protected the American uh, the American flag. Good for them. Trump, True Social, the auditor for True Social, is getting hit by the SEC. Hmm. I wonder why that is. See right through it. Trump, gag order. Well, let me tell you something, folks. Trump is ignoring the gag order and going out and speaking all he wants, daring him to throw him in jail. My guess it won't happen. The Columbia president, uh, no confidence vote. I, You can't make this up. And this is an original right here that I haven't heard one other news agency talk about. This will blow your mind. Are you ready for this? The IRS bragged that they've they've uh, received, as of April 15th, led to the collection of $520 million from wealthy taxpayers. Are you ready for this? The IRS has been bolstered by $80 billion in new funding directed by the Inflation Reduction Act. Folks, we give the IRS... $80 billion to help them raise $520 million? That is an economic disaster. That's how government works. Give us $80 billion so we can come up with $520 million from wealthy taxpayers. We've been better off. Let it all go. Keep the $80 billion. Unfreaking believable. Uh, Henry Cuellar, Democratic congressman from Texas, and his wife have been indicted for bribery. That hurts. Russians, can't make this up. Russians have went into Niger on our military base. Biden says the United States will never go bankrupt. Can't make it up because we can always print money. What the freaking hell? This is the guy who's the head of our country. 
All right, Hannity's house for sale out on Long Island. This is where the Hannity lives. All right, he's moving to Florida. Medal of Freedom was passed out to all the liberals. Nancy Pelosi. Uh, who's the female soccer player with the pink hair? Uh, Megan Rapino. She hates America. Why would we give her the Medal of Freedom? It's awful. Musk says, now this is what a real person knows economics. Musk says if we keep this debt going up, the dollar is going to be worthless. Hyperinflation. Buffett has sold his Paramount stake and his Apple stake. He admits Paramount was a problem. I hate that son of a bitch. All right. Found, uh, funders of the mob. Are you ready for the funders of the mob? It's not just Soros. The Bill Gates Foundation. Gnome. You know what Gnome said about defending the, she had to shoot the dog because it was killing livestock, her dog? She also said what's well, obvious that uh, Joe Biden's dog needs to be shot. You know, he's bitten Secret Service agents 20 times. And Israel is shutting down Al Jazeera in Israel. Good for them. This is the bulldog. Every dog has their day. Do not be a milk-livered, onion-eyed boar. I am crushing spindly and chest today.